I hate watching these Bill Nye videos. I rather watch paint dry. And it's not, it doesn't say I, it just says I. And I gotta tell you, have you ever watched paint dry? Let me ask you something. Does it dry from the top first and the bottom later? Or does it dry from the bottom first and the top later? You could find out. I think you must realize that some people are going to go to your show at the planetarium and they're going to say, aha, those scientists have discovered God because God, dark matter, is what holds this universe together. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. If you base medicine on, on science, you cure people. If you base the design of planes on science, they fly. Um, if you base the design of rockets on science, they reach the moon. It works, bitches. A wiener. That is one hot dog. Just look at the history of everybody doing big projects, and it's never driven by exploration. It's never driven by science. It's never driven by curiosity. Not if it's big and expensive. It's driven by the fact that people don't want to die. So there's a war driver. It's also driven by the fact that people want to get wealthy. So no, there's no, a money on, we have the large, have the large Hadron Collider. The Large Hadron Collider. The Large Hadron Collider. Do you know? Oh, no. <laughs> Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. A real gangster ass nigga plays his cards right. A real gangster ass nigga never runs his fucking mouth because real gangster ass niggas don't start fights. Bill Nye here, and I'm just reviewing some of the mean tweets. People bother, they take the time to tweet about me. Listening to Tifus Bus, Bill Nye sucks butthole. Hmm. Did not know that. Bill Nye made me hate science to a whole new level because he thought it was fun, and I think it still sucks. Thank you. I hate Bill Nye. That guy is so annoying. Like, so annoying. Um, you stated that you believe there could be an infinite number of parallel universes. Does that mean that there is a universe out there where I am smarter than you? Yes, and also a universe where you're funny. We all watched this show when we were kids with Carl Sagan. What is it like to step into his turtleneck? What if? You, you get to say the world is flat because we live in a country that guarantees your free speech, but it's not a country that guarantees that anything you say is correct. Our philosophy at New Scientist is this. Science is interesting, and if you don't agree, you can fuck off. Bill Nye the Science Guy is trippy as fuck. Now, I don't know exactly how trippy fuck is, but I imagine it's excessively. We're not going to rehash what we talked about on the panel last week. We debated global warming. Two of the people did not believe in it. Oh, no, one person didn't believe it. Two of them didn't believe in evolution. Uh, you know, the good thing about science is that it's true whether or not you believe in it. You see, that's the... <laughs> Okay. Very good. Okay. Can you make Go a sex it. tape on Mars? I think so. It's 40% of the gravity. Okay. Oh. Just think you'd be not floating. So there'd that? be like this whole, like, less than half. You accept that humans evolved from apes? Yeah, probably. From Neanderthals, yes. Whether... Okay. From Neanderthals? Probably. 
Why from Neanderthals? Well, why, who else? Who else would you suggest? <laughs> Regulators. You regulate any stealing of his property. We're damn good, too. How about you are about to be executed? Oh, I'm about to be executed. You have nothing except your knowledge and your, your knowledge of science, your experience. I would request that my body in death be buried, not cremated, so that the energy content contained within it gets returned to the earth so that flora and fauna can dine upon it, just as I have dined upon flora and fauna throughout my life. Having looked at a lot of your work, I'm curious, uh, what star sign are you? Are you serious? Six million ways to die, choose one. Do you actually believe in your Muslim faith? Do you believe that Muhammad split the moon in two? Do you believe that Muhammad flew to heaven on a winged horse, for example? I, I pay you the compliment of assuming that you, that you don't. No, I do. I believe in miracles. You believe that? Yes. You believe that Muhammad went to heaven on a winged horse? Yes, I believe in God. I believe in miracles. I believe in revelation. I mean, the point here is that let's assume I'm wrong, Richard. I'm yeah, wrong. Yeah, let's.